What is going on you guys? It's the Jimmy Fan here on Jimmy Master Animatronics. What we have to review for you guys today is uh, something really cool. I actually got this as a gift from Joseph aka Totally Awesome or Totally Animatronics uh, within the few days that he was over here so thank you so much for this thing. I really enjoy it. I mean honestly it's probably one of my all-time favorite big heads. Um, it definitely outweighs the rest of them in my opinion. Uh, this is the Big Head Animated Singing Dancing Werewolf. Um, I think this is actually the first generation from 2001, um, as depicted on the box. It's got the original box style, and you know, later on in 2002 they changed it to that purple box. And then they transitioned to the, uh, to the clear, I mean, yeah, to the clear window boxes with, or with orange siding and everything, uh, with the 1588 sticker on it or something like that. But, um... Yeah, this is the original model, which is what I actually wanted because I like the box style and it goes with the rest of them. The only one I don't have the 2001 box style for is the Witch. I have the 02 and the rest are the 01. Uh, but aside from the Universal um, Big Head Bride of Frankenstein and the Frankenstein itself, I'm pretty much complete with the with the rest of the generic ones. But uh, So it's great to have him. He's in fully working condition and he actually came that way when I got him aside from a split gear in the head, but as you can see... I've since replaced that gear and he's working great. Uh, the only thing that concerns me just a little bit is that the hip mechanism is a little bit yellowed but it's still held together just fine and if it shatters one day for whatever reason, it shouldn't because I can take good care of these things. Um, but if it does for whatever reason, I got a spare or I can whip one out of that 3D printer once I start making some things. But anyways, I guess we'll get to the box first. The fact that it has the box is really cool. And they're very expensive on eBay, I noticed. I mean, I don't know what's going on with the price, the, <laughs> the price, but the price fl uh, fluctuation with these things. But, I mean, they're not cheap. Uh, sometimes you'll find them for $24, and sometimes you'll find them for $230. I mean, I just don't understand it. But uh, anyways, we'll get to the box first. It says, Big Head, uh, pictured smaller than actual height of 18 inches. Usually I'd say the opposite, but... um. 20 bucks, right up there, ages 8 and up. It says, mouth moves, let's see, moves his mouth to the words of the song, eyes light up, turns his head and dances, says Halloween phrases. And if you notice, it's a little bit brighter in this area. Let me guys, let, let, um, let me know what you guys think of the, of the, uh, the brightness. Because I, I actually installed, oh good lord, I actually installed um, LEDs into this fixture instead of warm lights. And they seem to give off a uh, brighter effect or cleaner effect on my reviews for sure, so that's cool. Um, sings and dances to clap for the Wolfman. It's got, of course, like all the other older box styles, it says he's got rhythm, he's got style, he can dance and sing, and he's got a very big head. What an entertaining Halloween trick and treat. Just press the button, he'll respond with a, so with a song and dance or maybe a word or two. Don't miss him, whatever you do. They basically have all that. Um, that's just the generic description for the big head characters. I'm not really sure on the which. Jimmy Industries Corporation 2001. Really, really cool item overall, and I'm very happy to finally have it. I'm surprised I hadn't already had it after so many years of collecting these big heads and the figurines, but the fact that I do is very, uh, very satisfying for sure. So enough of me talking, let's get to the item. We'll play them a couple more times. Really great song. What do you want? Oh, 
And one cool thing I like about this one that I have in particular is that the mouth does not clank um, very obnoxiously like some of the other ones do. Um, but he is pretty high pitched for being the first generation, I'd say. Um, a lot of the other ones are a lot lower pitched than this one, but uh, it's great to have them overall. And that pretty much completes my big head generic collection, and now I just got to get the Frankenstein and the Bride of Frankenstein. And uh, that should wrap it up for sure. So to close out this video, we'll play it one last time for you guys.